God. Praise the Lord. Praise God. I, at the very onset, I need to mention the fact that in my theological training, I have deep roots in the Methodist Church where I had desired to become a minister. And so you would note the high of pure Pentecostals and the Methodists as they come in because they come in at a different level. You, you, so you gotta pardon my training. Pardon my training. Then at the same time, I've got to warn you just in case you get, you get ahead of yourself. That Queen Togozo mean before Uncleba, before Uncleba. Queen Togozo and Kulu mean Ugutting is a toll. Pagati, Queen Ganizan Kulunku and about Fundisi. Abba says Zingini El Pezu Gagak. Gakongia Bong. Uguti Nati is now I'm a voice by Mumriri. Apa game. Kukon is a pet in Kosiami. Ognanyan and Jay. I got an Akogia Sindis. So I've done with those that were just about to gossip about me. Second Valim Lomone. Amen. So, beloved, my greetings to you is in no other name but in the powerful name of our Lord Jesus Christ. And I want to greet you tonight, or this evening, or this early night, with Psalm 133. And it says, Behold how good and how pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity. So, as perfecting fellowship, and we come together at the service, we haven't just gathered haphazardly. No miganjani, no. We come from diverse nations. We come from different tribes. And different socializations and we gather together as perfecting fellowship it's not a haphazard getting together there's meaning to us getting together in that we know that as we gather together and we are united in these closing times That when we are united, there's a benefit to unity. Bishop spoke about the seven benefits, and I want to say tonight there's an eighth benefit. And the latter part of verse 3 says, For there, when you're united, for there the Lord commanded his blessing, even life forevermore. So our gathering has purpose, but our gathering also carries a blessing. And so this afternoon as you gather, and as we gather with our friends and family and our loved ones, under the banner of Perfecting Fellowship International, I pray that God, in some way, and in some form, will meet you tonight. That you came and maybe something that probably has not been touched for a long time. But as you receive the word of God, something will stir up in your spirit. Something that has been dead for a long time will come alive again because of the grace and the presence of God in this place. And we cannot doubt the presence of God in this place because as... Apostle uh, Matlangu sang, we sense the presence of God. 
And in my heart, I said, Lord, uh, indeed, you are here. Because where God is, possibilities become limitless. God bless you.